To understand position vector in much more detail, let's move to this question which will felicitate our understanding in more detail. It says let PQRS be a parallelogram. So you have been given a parallelogram which is PQRS. If PQR be the position vectors of point PQR, that means small p, small q, small r are respectively the position vectors of the given points capital P, capital Q, capital R. Then what, what are we supposed to find? We have to find the position vector of S. So I write solution and let's find what is the position vector of capital S. Since you have been given a geometrical figure which is a parallelogram, so you have to draw a parallelogram first in rough sketch probably or in fair so as to understand the question better. So let me draw a parallelogram since it is not drawn with the help of a ruler or a scale, it might vary in its measurements. So you have been given P, Q, R, S and specifically P here, it would be Q here, it would be R here and it would be S here, right? Now see PQ is there, it is parallel to SR. You are supposed to find the position vector of S, let it be small s. Now I start the solution, I say let small s be position vector of capital S because small s is there. Now that is not the answer. If you see, we are supposed to find the position vector of capital S. If I say small s is the answer, that is not correct because you have to write small s in terms of these given vectors PQR. Now, I know that PQ would be equal to SR because PQ is parallel to SR and in a parallelogram, the opposite sides are equal as well as parallel. Now, PQ is what? If you talk in terms of the position vector, PQ means the final minus initial. Every time in position vector, remember this formula. Final minus initial. So, PQ means Q vector minus P vector. Here also, SR. What is SR? PQ is equal to SR. SR means the final minus initial. Means R vector minus S vector. What are we supposed to find? S vector. So, the answer is R vector plus P vector minus Q vector to this question which required us to find S vector. So S vector is equal to this is R vector plus P vector minus Q vector.